pray for Nollywood veteran actor John Okafor, aka Mr. Ibo. Guys, in today's video, we are begging on you all to please take some few minutes of your precious time to pray for Nollywood actor Mr. Ibo. Well, he is known professionally as John Okafor. Well, something very very unusual happened to this man and he wants to believe that his wife is the one behind everything that has been happening to him i mean if you all can recall i think you clearly remember the time when this man was actually admitted in the hospital and one thing led to another information actually came out on the internet confirming the fact that this man was somehow poisoned i mean this is something that happens almost on a daily i mean in this part of the world but for somebody like this someone this funny someone this jovial why would someone actually want him down well that's actually a question we have to ask ourselves too welcome again to another video right in this same channel just love and niger do all to please hit the subscribe button before proceed and of course turn on the bell notification button so you can be the first to be notified whenever we post or upload a new video in this same channel and if i tell you my long time subscriber god bless you for me getting right back into the video we're going to be talking about nollywood veteran actor john okafor aka mr ibu well you should actually know this man but if at all you don't know him then i'll be actually so honored and pleased to tell you guys a little bit about john okafor well this man happens to be a comic actor more like he's into the comedy part of movies in the industry I mean, if you should watch his movies, you would actually find out that it's centered around making you laugh. It's centered around just making you feel happy. I mean, just some really funny things always coming out from his mouth. Well, he has been in the industry for decades. Reason why he's been termed an Odogu, someone really known in the industry, someone that we've known for decades. Well, to talk about what happens to be ongoing right now, I mean, we all know that in every matrimonial home, uh, there are actually issues, but it actually becomes very different and it takes a U-turn when those issues are brought online. I mean, what do you actually expect netizens to say? Well, for some of you guys that will be asking, netizens happens to be the citizens online all the citizens on the internet so they are just being termed netizens so when you start bringing your matrimonial issues or your marital issues online believe me i don't really feel like you are going to have a solution because what john okafor's wife did i mean this lady happens to be called stella okafor she somehow brought her issues online more like brought her marital issues online and of course accused john okafor of having an affair with one jasmine and information has it that jasmine happens to be stella okafor's stepdaughter and of course she wants to just believe that this man is somehow having an affair with jasmine well the question now is why would someone have an affair with his own daughter this is something so ridiculous because stella okafor happens to be the second wife and john okafor happens not to still be with the first wife and jasmine was actually the daughter of john okafor's first wife so this lady wants to believe that stella okaf this lady wants to believe that john okafor is having an affair with jasmine who happens to be his own daughter this is ridiculous but all the same please pray for john okafor and we are really emphasizing on this prayer request because this man actually came out online and said his wife is making things difficult for him and he also made it very clear that one of the reasons behind the fact that he has not fully recovered is the fact that his wife keeps disturbing him day in day out i mean why would you actually make videos like this if you all are watching you should actually see videos that this lady videotaped of their household of her house with john okafor and posted it online we still find this very improper because if you're having issues then please keep it on a low look for the most amicable 
tangible way to solve your issues you mustn't necessarily bring them online because when you start bringing your issues or your marital problems online there is never going to be a solution people will just joke around and say funny things laugh at you but nobody really feels what you're going through nobody really understands what you're going through so please if you're out there and you're having issues just the way john okafor is having his issues with his wife stella okafor please do all to look for an amicable way to solve it without bringing those issues online because believe me you will not get any solution online you will just get people laughing at you people making fun of you this and that at the end of the day no solution you just get disgrace here and there and it's not really going to make any sense right well we just pray that may this man somehow solve his issues with his wife and of course he shouldn't even get to the point where he should pass on because this is actually what he said i mean he literally told an interviewer that if anything should happen to him then they should know that his wife is behind it all the same we're going to put him in our prayers i will pray that you all should do that as well thank you for watching Thank you for stopping by. Do subscribe before leaving and turn on the bell notification icon. Thanks once again.